Munchies, what's going on? Alicia here, if you're new, I am so excited to welcome you to the channel and all of the summer content we have coming your way. Every year, you guys seem to want more drinks. So we've got lemonades, limeades, and iced teas today, and we're also turning them into popsicles because why not? I mean, most of the work is already done, right? Also, for those fans of summer treats, I have a new ebook with over 40 popsicle, ice cream, sorbets, and froyo recipes. It's available right now at mindovermunch.com slash ebooks. Discount to come at the end? First up is a matcha lemonade. Boil water and then remove from the heat and stir in quality matcha powder and sweetener. You wanna make sure that you use a high quality matcha, which will be bright green, not dull. Once dissolved, add freshly squeezed lemon juice and cold water. Chill that for a few hours and then serve over ice. Dang, that is fresh. Matcha and lemon pair super well together, especially when your matcha is high quality. It should not be bitter, but instead naturally sweet and sort of earthy or with grassy notes. I like my lemonade sweet, but the beauty of this recipe is you are in control of how much sugar or sweetener you want to add. And then you can take that and turn it into a popsicle easy peasy. Pour the liquid into your popsicle mold. Freeze a few hours or overnight and boom, fresh matcha lemonade popsicles. What a fun summer day treat for you or your main squeeze. See what I did there? Next, let's swap from lemons to limes for the sparkling watermelon limeade. First, make your watermelon juice. I simply blend watermelon chunks and then strain. Muddle some lime zest and mint in the bottom of a pitcher. Add some ice, pour in your fresh squeezed lime and watermelon juice along with seltzer water. Mix with a spoon and serve. Of course, you can make this a lemonade and use lemons instead, and you can use regular water instead of seltzer, but I love the bubbly in this one. I also love that watermelon in summer is so sweet. I need no sweetener at all. Just like before, this mixture will freeze well as popsicles. And if you've never tried fizzy pops, now is the time. We interrupt your free programming to let you know that you are one in a melon. And for that great pun, and for me wearing this costume, uh, could you please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe? I deserve it! Moving on to summer tea with this orange pomegranate iced tea. Combine water, orange slices, cinnamon, and cloves. Bring to a boil, add sweetener, and stir until dissolved. Remove from the heat and add black tea bags. Cover and steep for about five minutes and then you can strain the mixture. Combine tea with freshly squeezed orange juice and pomegranate juice. Cover and chill for a few hours or overnight and serve over ice. Citrus and tea pair so well and the pomegranate juice gives a fruity and floral boost. I actually like this one hot and cold and of course even colder as an ice pop too. Let's cool off a bit more with the strawberry and basil limeade slushy. I blend frozen strawberries, basil, lime juice, and sweetener of choice, I like honey here. Adjust sweetness to your preference and add a bit of water to get it to your preferred thickness. I like to serve this one to eat with a spoon. Fresh, zesty, fragrant, and this is probably my favorite one for a popsicle, it's already halfway there. If you are a fan of frozen treats, you may or may not know, I host a monthly giveaway for my newsletter subscribers, and this month I am giving away a legit ice cream machine. If you are subscribed, you're already entered to win. Winners are announced in the newsletter. If you aren't subscribed, go head over there now and subscribe at mindovermunch.com. The link is in my description. I give away new stuff every single month because free stuff rocks. The last one of the day is an anti-inflammatory ginger ale. I add water, honey, and ginger to a pot. Bring to a boil, turn off the heat, and then stir in some cayenne and turmeric. Steep 10 minutes, strain, and refrigerate until cold. 
Add the ginger aid mixture along with fresh lemon juice and additional water to a pitcher and stir until combined. Serve over ice. If you've ever had a lemon cayenne ginger shot, I've pretty much turned that into a drinkable lemonade. And you can also get the immune boosting kick in popsicle form, no problem. I hope you enjoyed these summer beverages. They are so versatile, you can really get creative and swap in or out your favorite fruits, citrus, teas, and more. If you aren't a drinks person, then enjoy them in popsicle form. You can't go wrong. Remember, at mindofvermunch.com slash ebooks, you can get my new frozen summer treats ebook and get 10% off any ebook or package this week only with the code LEMONADE. I'll see you next week, and remember, it's all a matter of mind over munch.